Hi everyone, my name is Aruiz and I live in Vancouver. I am the co-founder of Arbo Pacific and Econova Education. With climate change, water temperature increase. Thankfully, oceans absorb 93% of the energy budget. However, oceans are so vast, the increase in temperature is measured by just a tenth of a degree. Still, it has multiple consequences. At the surface level, when both air temperature and water temperature increase, it causes more evaporation. So this means more clouds, more rain, and the disruption of the water cycle. Also, in the intertropical zone, warmer water surface tend to increase the power of cyclones. In New Caledonia, constructors are currently discussing how to best adapt, whether to go for stronger and reinforced buildings or cheaper and lighter buildings that will be easier to replace. At the deeper level, when water warms up, it expands and the volume of water increase, which can cause sea level rise. Marine biodiversity may also be affected, especially corals. And finally, methane hydrate may start melting, releasing the CH4 methane that they have trapped and causing a negative feedback loop.